Well, hi there, everyone. Steve Watkins here with the Real Foot Devotional uh, in Hornbeak, Tennessee, except at the moment, I am not in Hornbeak. I am actually recording uh, on a side street somewhere here in Sparta, Illinois. And y'all, I have just done, I have just done a thing. I've just done something that I have always wanted to do a very long time. I just bought a food truck. I am scared to death and completely, totally excited all at once. I think my voice is even shaking after having just done that moments ago, right around the corner. I was thinking about it on the four hour drive up here and I knew there was a possibility that I would buy the truck. And I was thinking about an old friend, Sammy Lewis, back in Jonesboro who had a barbecue establishment. And in his logo, Sammy had a verse of scripture in his logo from Mark six. And it's the parable of the feeding of the 5,000 Jesus and the disciples were wandering the countryside. He was going around teaching. And at this particular moment, a crowd had gathered. 5,000 people had gathered. It was getting late in the afternoon. The disciples were all nervous and anxious about what to do. They didn't know how to handle the crowd. And Jesus said, you give them something to eat. A lot of you who have followed me over the years know that I loved Anthony Bourdain. I loved his passion for travel and I loved his passion for food. And I love that Anthony Bourdain understood. Anthony Bourdain was not an angel. <laughs> Gosh, I was in a Waffle House when Anthony Bort, when I heard the news that he was killed or had, we'd lost him. Anthony Bourdain understood that bringing people together at a table did something special. And in all the places Dana and I have traveled, whether it was in Europe or South America or wherever we were, we have we have shared in that experience of sitting at a table with people from around the world, different cultures, different beliefs, Christians, atheists, agnostics, and how the food brought us together. And I treasure those memories. So we're in the food truck business now. <laughs> we'll set up uh, in a couple of weeks I've got a little work to do on the truck, but it's almost ready to go. Bought it from a young couple, a lovely young couple here in Sparta. And as we're doing with the lodge that was Hobie's Lodge, I mean, I hope to continue this young couple's legacy of serving people and, and making food with love. I hope we, I pray that we serve them well. Until tomorrow, guys, onward.